There is a jog mode and manual mode. Okay. In the jog mode means so at that time we want to move the axis, either the z axis or x axis, 10 mm or 15 mm, whatever amount of the m uh, distance you are given, that distance it will move it will go for the jog mode. Okay. Or if you want to operate the manual, then you can select the manual mode. And here there is a uh, see here there is a z axis, y axis, and x axis. For the lathe machine, only the x and z axis are there. X is controlling the diameter of the workpiece and Z is controlling the length of the workpiece. Okay. Now let us uh, uh, verify this Z. Okay. And uh, you see that it will move. So the Z axis here moving this way along the Z axis, Z direction. Okay. Now if you set in X, then the diameter control it will take. So manually you can operate uh, this movement of the tool with respect to the workpiece. Okay. So before uh, the start the machine, you have to set the workpiece and the original of the is given x value 0 and y value 0, that is a centimeter. That already done on the picture of the problem. Now the master starts the operation. 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 See that it will move in the z direction and x axis. So, whatever the distance you set here, uh, microns you set that microns it will move. Okay, now, now let us uh, now let us see the operation. Now, to go for the auto then simply the cycle start. If you click the cycle start, what the program is prepared according to the program, it will be start. Now, let us see that how it will be happening. Now I started cycle. Now see that the cycle, how it will be performing. Okay. So now you see the tool is moving from the home position to the entry position. Okay. Now let us first we'll start the phase turning. So after phase turning, then step turning will start. Okay. Now let us see that. Now the phase turning is going on. So once completed the phase turning, then it will goes to the step turning. So now it's a phase turning is going on. So carefully observe that how the movements of the tools are moving. Now see this first step. Overall length it's a plane turning is taking place. So after completion of the overall length, now you can you can carefully observe that how the tool is coming back at what speed. So now the speed is given. With the speed, the tool is moving. So once in the reverse gear, it uh, it's coming with maximum speed. Now carefully observe that. Oh, see how that. Uh, so that is the ideal. In ideal position, it's coming very fast. Like we had prepared the four steps. Like I have given the four steps. So according to the given program, this uh, steps uh, operation will be performed. If you carefully observe how a very fast, that is the maximum speed, whatever the speed you set, with that speed the, the drive will move back. Continuous shift. So you can see that programming here on the panel screen that uh, what the program is there that can also visible. You can also edit the program as per well your requirement. You can also observe that what is the movement of X and Z the coordinates directly that the movement of the two coordinates will display here. So that code block, this block and uh, this code X movement, that movement also can observe here.
the program is completed now the four steps uh, now just i open the i i open the uh, chart by pressing this uh, key you can see if you press here yeah. it will come and this workplace okay now this is the uh, job we have given the four steps according to the program the machining is completed